It was a real pri uh, privilege for me to serve on this uh, task force. Uh, as others have said, you know, the debate throughout was extremely merits focused, extremely harmonious, and really is a credit to the Stimson Center's values in terms of bringing uh, experienced people together in our national interest for a discussion of the real issues uh, uh, rather than red herring or political issues. Um, I, it's hard for me to add much to what folks have said in terms of the targeted killings issue, um, but one thing that uh, I think is worth highlighting is uh, uh, the points that were, are made in the report about what, what are not issues. Um, a lot of the media focus, a lot of the public focus or political focus sometimes goes on issues that we think are more of a distraction than uh, moving the debate forward on what the real issues is. You know, we haven't hesitated to be critical, obviously, or to uh, point out ways we think the programs can be improved. But um, issues that are raised sometimes in terms of, uh, you know, whether these weapons uh, lead to greater civilian casualties than uh, uh, traditional weapons, uh, issues about whether they are, um, you know, a, a, a low-cost way to fight wars, um, uh, issues about whether they promote a video game mentality. Uh, we think those are actually distractions, and I, you can read the report, but those issues are ones that probably there's less there than meets the eye. Um, and instead, the issues that uh, my uh, fellow task force members have focused on are really where we should be debating in terms of transparency and accountability, rule of law, et cetera, and it, particularly the international dimension, which others have highlighted, I think is very important as we are, uh, we, it's not just ourselves uh, that we need to think about here. We need to think about other, how other countries are going to administer their programs because that day is coming. 